A new study definitively confirms the Gulf Stream is weakening. What does that mean for us? Well, the Gulf Stream transport of water through the Florida Straits has slowed by 4% over the past four decades. And this is with 99% certainty that this weakening is more than expected from random chance, according to a new study. Here. Now, the Gulf Stream, which is a major ocean current off the U.S. East Coast and part of the North Atlantic Ocean circulation, plays an important role in weather and climate, and a weakening could have significant implications on the future of the climate. In this paper, they conclude with a high degree of confidence that the Gulf Stream transport has indeed slowed by about 4% in the past 40 years. The first conclusive, unambiguous, observational evidence that this ocean current has undergone significant change in the recent past, states the journal article, which we see here, robust weakening of the Gulf Stream during the past four decades observed in the Florida Straits. This was published in the Geophysical Research Letters. Now, the Florida Straits here is located between the Florida Keys, Cuba, and the Bahamas and has been the site of many ocean observation campaigns dating to the 80s and earlier. This significant trend has emerged from the data set only over the past 10 years. The first unequivocal evidence for a recent multi-decadal decline in this climate-relevant component of ocean circulation. Now, the Gulf Stream affects regional weather, climate, and coastal conditions, including European surface air temperatures and precipitation, coastal sea levels along the southeastern U.S., and North Atlantic hurricane activity. Understanding past Gulf Stream changes is important for interpreting observed changes and predicting future trends in extreme events, including droughts, floods, heat waves, and storms. According to the article, determining trends in the Gulf Stream transport is also relevant for clarifying whether elements of the large-scale North Atlantic circulation have changed, which could mean devastating things to Europe and to determine how the ocean is feeding back on climate. Now, this is the strongest, most definitive evidence we have a weakening of this climatically relevant ocean current, said Chris Pekush, a physical oceanographer at the Woods Hole Oceanographic Institution, who is the lead author of the study. The paper does not conclude whether this Gulf Stream weakening is due to climate change, and for good measure, because this is probably natural factors. And the lead author stated that future studies should try to identify the cause of the weakening, because it may be significant in the future. Now, for the study, researchers applied what is known as Bayesian modeling to combine thousands of data points from three independent data sets, from undersea cables, satellite altimetry, and in situ observations to determine the transport of water through the Florida Strait since 1982. And this type of modeling uses probability to represent uncertainty within a model. And they saw quite a significant trend downwards, as you can see here in all of the data sets, including here with the purple line. Once they synthesized the testimony from all the different witnesses, they painted a very clear picture that indeed, over the past 40 years, the Gulf Stream has weakened by about 4%, which is significant. It's more than you would expect if the current was stable. So it's an important change in this system. Now, they've been studying western boundary currents for 30 years. And it's only now that they are able to observe a robust trend in one of these extraordinary dynamic systems.
So what does it mean for the long term? No, the day after tomorrow isn't happening. But many people are using this paper as evidence of such a thing. When in fact, a 4% weakening in four decades is not going to do anything catastrophic and anything immediate anytime soon. The shutdown of the AMOC takes time. Time takes time. Now, a sudden burst of the Beaufort Gyre may accelerate the shutdown of the AMOC and may, in fact, bring it to a grinding halt quite rapidly. But it would take years for the climatic effects to take hold and for anything to look like this picture. And that, well, that's good news and also a boom to knowledge. Please share this video as we are shadow banned and we need your help to grow. Become a Patreon, support the work we do, and watch all of our content in one place commercial free. And most importantly, be safe. We love you. And that is a boom.